द एफेक्टिव रेसिस्टेंस बिटवीन ए एंड पी सो वन अब्सर्व द गि सर्क्यूट डयाग्राम वी वॉन्ट टू फैंड द एफेक्टिव रेसिसन बिटवीन ए एंड बी हियर थ्री वोम रेसिस्टर एंड दिस थ्री वोम रेसिस्टर दीज टू रेसिस्टर्स आर् कनेक्टेड एंड टू एंड सीरी कनेक्शन so equivalent resistance of these two resistors r s1 is equals to 3 ohm plus 3 ohm that is equals to 6 ohm so now circuit 6 ohm and again here another 6 ohm resistor is there this point is a point so now the remaining circuit is the same here this 6 ohm resistor and this 6 ohm resistor these two are parallel to each other so directly only two parallel resistors so take the formula r1 r2 by r1 plus r2 So six into six by six plus six, thirty-six by twelve. That is equals to three ohm. And now this resistor and this resistor, these two are in series. So R S two is equals to three plus three equals to six ohm. so now here we get 6 ohm resistor and here 6 ohm resistor there is no another resistor here so now once observe here this 6 ohm resistor and 6 ohm resistor so these two terminals at one point and next to two terminals also at this point this connection is a parallel connection so 6 into 6 by 6 plus 6 is equals to 3 ohm here this is 3 ohm This one three ohm, six ohm, three ohm, and this part is three ohm. So now once look here, this three ohm resistor and this three ohm resistor, end to end connection. So equivalent resistance of these two resistors again becomes to six ohm. Six ohm, and now the circuit diagram. Here, six ohm at the same point here. Six ohm, and here another resistor three ohm, and here another resistor three ohm. So this point is A, and this point is B. Look here, this six ohm, six ohm. these two resistors parallel so now rp3 is equals to 3 ohm so here we get 3 ohm here 3 ohm here 3 ohm so now here again 3 ohm 3 ohm these two resistors in series so 3 plus 3 equals to 6 ohm and now 6 ohm and here 3 ohm 
point A, point B. Now finally these two resistors are in parallel. So 6 into 3 by 6 plus 3, 18 by 9. So that is equals to 2 ohm. Equivalent resistance in between A and B is equals to 2 ohm. So second option is correct.